Yeah, so I think that WXGO offers a really unique uh, opportunity to students. It's not every college that allows students who are just any major, any background to join the radio station um, and then be able to do like what really whatever they want so long as it falls in the FCC guidelines. So when people join WXQ, they'll first work with our uh, operations manager. They'll get paired with a DJ who's been here for a little while um, and be trained uh, through observation and then like slowly a little more airtime where the DJ that's training them will really show them uh, the how-to of what they're doing and whatnot. And then eventually after all that training, they'll take a little test. And if they pass that test, then they'll get to have their own radio show. Um, it's required for every DJ to make a visual poster and then a show promo that airs like an ad over the radio station. So yeah, every, every person who becomes a DJ just has to make one for their show. They get to title their show, whatever they'd like, um, whatever theme they'd like. And really it's a free form station so they can play whatever music they like to and just make a visual that kind of represents their show. And then make a short little ad that, you know, tells people when their show is. We just had a Valentine's Day fundraiser, which was pretty cool, but unfortunately that already passed. So up next, we are going to be doing Vinylthon. Um, and even though, like, the public can't really, like, participate in that, um, in April, basically, we will be playing vinyls for 24 hours over the radio. So I think just, like, be tuning in and listening to that and getting to kind of experience that, because, like, you know, they do sound different. And it's just a really fun thing that all the DJs who help out that really enjoy. And then something that everyone can really get in on um, in April as well, we're doing a virtual concert. So we don't have too many specific details quite yet. However, we're going to get some uh, Millersville local bands and then also some other uh, little more established bands from other areas to uh, join in and do a concert over Zoom. So really like we're going to live stream it and anybody can join in and watch that. We're going to try to help boost some local businesses as well to really help the community. So that's definitely something that students can look forward to and we should have more details.